It is documented that on the morning of February the 19th, 1917, the German submarine UC-18 attacked the Lady Olive, and both vessels were said to have sunk some eight miles west of Jersey. Yet neither have ever been found. What's particularly interesting about this battle, it is the only known naval encounter between a ship and a submarine where both sank each other. They begin their descent into the inky black gloom. But it's not what they're looking for. The search begins. The first two things to remember when researching shipwreck is don't believe anything you read in the book. The second is with original documents, always remember that they are written to explain the loss of a vessel to a superior. The trail goes cold. The evidence from both these vessels lies at the bottom of the sea, and we don't know where. No one knows what this wreckage is. No one's dived it, no one's seen it, no one knows what that ship could be. There's only one way to be certain and that's to dive her. They are both excited and apprehensive as to what awaits them. But the question remains, whether UC-18 was sunk or escaped from the Lady Olive. That the battle could not have taken place here, it must have been further to the west. My concern is that we haven't found the wreck. Mm. Uh, we should be able to find a submarine. Unfortunately, He's got the wreck with a big forefoot. This is James's original handwritten diaries. It's over 105 years old. They all kind of form a pattern on that line of travel. The team decide they should investigate the site further and make plans for a deep dive cannot afford to have any, any mishaps or accidents. Out of the gloom, a shape reveals itself. 